So point number 15, the 15th secret to becoming the world champion of public speaking or the 15th secret being the world's best speaker. It is the three R's. Now, what are the three R's? Three R's are rehearse, record, and review. So what do I mean by that? Rehearse is you, you keep practicing a speech word for word. Remember this, word for word. You practice a speech till it becomes second nature to you, where anyone can wake you up in the middle of the night and you're able to deliver the speech flawlessly, flawlessly without any single mistake. So that's the first R, rehearse. The second part, which is very important, is for you to record. Like right now, I am recording this on my iMac, and it's the video that's capturing me. So I'm recording this, okay, recording this. And the third R is review. So after you've recorded it, okay, you review it, okay? You review it, and you look at it, and you ask yourself, okay, so what did I do? Okay, what did I do wrong? The beauty of doing this is once you rehearse, obviously, you want to deliver your best. You want to be the best. So... You know, you'll keep practicing until you're the best. So you rehearse. But now you do not know where you stand. So the next step is to record it, like how I'm doing. You record it with your voice, with how you look, with how you move, gestures, everything else. The third part is the review. When you review it, this is a very important point that I'll give you. Jot down all the areas that you would like to review about yourself. Jot down, let's say, for example, the opening body conclusion. Uh, jot down the content. Is it interesting, not interesting? The eye movement, the, the facial expressions, the hand gestures, the leg gestures, the movement, uh, the staging, uh, how effective the person was, uh, mistakes that the person has done. So write down all these points. And out of each, each area, each segment, review it out of 10. Note down, if 10 is the world's best in this category, how much would I rate this person? Or another example, uh, how you can uh, uh, get this done is, write down all these points and compare yourself to the world's best speaker. Let's say, for example, you consider Obama a powerful speaker. Compare yourself head to head with Obama. So Obama's gestures, your gestures. Obama's vocal variety, your variety. Obama's uh, uh, fluency, your fluency. So note down each and, and compare yourself. If Obama is at 10, where do you rate yourself? Okay, so once after you get this, you would know your average and you know in each and every area where you need to improve on. So if suppose you are at six out of 10, okay, ask yourself, what can I do to push the six to a seven? And then keep analyzing, keep asking yourself. And once you get the answer for this, then do the same thing all over again. Okay, keeping in mind that one area, let's say, for example, your gestures, let's say you have a habit of moving your left hand and because you keep moving your left hand in a very distracting manner you rated yourself let's say a four out of ten so ask yourself okay my hand keeps moving and that's distracting so that's why i rated myself four out of ten what can i do to make it a five out of ten so as you move it say okay fine i'll not move my left this much i'll move my left in a more controlled manner and i'll balance it out with the right so instead of moving your hand every time you kind of move your hand slowly but then you move your right as well. So when you check your video and you're like, oh, wow, I have improved. So you give yourself a five out of 10. So from four out of 10, you move to a five out of 10. Or, you know, like I said, I don't know whether I give it six. You move from uh, four out of 10, you move it to five out of 10. Once you are from four to five, then you ask yourself, how can you move from a five to a six, then from a six to a seven, then from a seven to an eight. So every time you move one step at a time, and that is how you become better. Okay, try the same with eye movement, try the same with vocal variety, try the same with pronunciation, try the same with uh, movement on stage. So that's how you do it. You record, you, rehe you, you rehearse, you record, you review. And then obviously the last R is repeat the whole process all over again. So remember, it, it's, it's the first time you, uh, this is one thing which I want you to keep in mind. The first time you look at yourself uh, on video, you'd hate yourself. You'd hate the way you sound. You hate the way you look. It's normal. It's natural, but it's very necessary for you to do this because how you look, how you sound, is a reality of what you are showing yourself to the world. So, point number fifteen in the fifteenth secret to becoming the world champion in public speaking or being the world's greatest speaker speaker is rehearse, record, and review. And if you want an extra hour, it will repeat the process till you achieve perfection. This is Lloyd Macedo. I hope you enjoyed my uh, video session. 
If you have any questions, please send it to me at loy at loymacedo.com. Do share and like this video. And remember, if you'd like to donate to my channel, that is through PayPal, loy at loymacedo.com. I look forward to hearing from you. Goodbye.